very well i select here for example actually these two as you can see are very close to each other one and two as you can see in these occasions we got an symbol named at elbow at elbow is always appeared at the direction of the symbol for example in this side we don't have but if i check you can see the at elbow so if you click on at elbow then you will see a curved line with 45 degrees actually this provides us to add some space between two symbols that are close to each other to just not being confused when printing the plan and we got the same in four can control the elbow in this way whatever position you want check this out this is used for two close grids so in this way you can recognize the numbers or the letters of your grids but the elbow is only applied in level one for example if i check level two or three four five six and seven add elbow is not applied on them check this out i press wt to arrange the views check this out in this way here as you can see add elbow is not applied but only on level 1 as you can see and right now i want to modify the scale of the level 7 to for example 150 so here in level 7 as the scale is greater than before and as you can see the distance between the grids is enough to observe them and recognize them while here in level 5 the scale is 100 and they are very close to each other so i change the, the scale of level 7 i open this and then i modify the scale 125 and here as you can see we got enough space so we got no problem there so i set 150 for level 7 and 125 for level 1 and for level 4 i click on show crab region here as you can see and then I minimize the frame in this way and then I place it in the grids in this way and after that if I want to apply all of the elbows and other levels you know if I set the add elbows I mean if I add elbows in each of the levels it takes a long time especially in big projects it just takes your time instead of spending it on more important details but the technique which Revit has granted to you, in this technique we need to revise one of the levels and then select in the modified lines. There up there we got an icon propagate extends, as you can see, which copies the extents and the appearance of datum elements to parallel views. So if I click on it, this is the window in which you can select your views. So here you can select the levels or views you want to apply these changes on them by just checking them in propagate the term extents but here we got some points that you should take them into consideration the first point here is that as you remembered um, i just have minimized the boundaries of the level four and then placed it on the grid as you can see so the region is minimized and here in propagate the term extent you can't you don't have level four and this is level 4 analytical which is different to level 4 as you know so we don't have level 4 in the list as you can see so here the point was that if if the crop boundary is placed on the uh, grids in this way you can't apply the changes with propagate extent since propagate extent does not support it so you should make sure about the crop boundaries to maximize them i mean the grids should be inside the crop boundaries so this was the first point so i turn this off and then i select these four lines i click on propagate extents another point here is that in the scale of 150 and 125 there is no need to adding elbow since there are enough space to read the symbols so in these occasions you should check only show views with the same scale as current so in this way you only observe the views which are which, which the, their scales are the same with your current view so if i check this level 7 with 150 and level 1 copy 1 with 125 are 
hidden from the list and if I uncheck check this out look in this way so I check it and then I select all of the items I select the first one and then press shift and then the last one and then I click on OK so then you will see that the elbow have been added on all of the views except level 7 and level 1 copy 1 since they are in different in scales in this way